Nightmare and Royster Part 1. Bill Bob! Yeah! I'm going over the place for cars. Well, damn, well, let's get on the phone in a while. <laughs> How about now, I've got this car. Hey, you're sitting by a goat. Yeah, she's going to call me. Kai, what's the game? Your game. Five cars. Yeah. You got it every time, every day or something. What every day about? And she keeps calling me, man. I don't know if I said she won't walk or not, man. I don't do it, man. I ain't done to it. <laughs> Damn, man, you got to see I that. I on trees all the time. <laughs> <laughs> you want to play that, that, that slap game you learned in old big hat? I mean, take it off. Just one time. One laser time. One, two, three. Oh, oh damn it. Go ahead, Bella. No to jail. Oh, oh boy. Oh, God. Oh, boy. Gotta get you every time. Cut them guards, boy. I ain't got one. Well, I dare you to have a three to a while. <laughs> I ain't got my knife on me, Bella. Let me go in and just do the whole shit. Cause you always wear a color. <laughs> and you always work the joker. <laughs> oh, God. I don't feel like I used to. <laughs> you don't, you don't, you don't. You hear something? Damn, if I did. It must be my old hair. It's acting up again. You remember all them days back? Hey, what I'm leery of this old hair for house. You heard the story, haven't you? Five car draw. No, that's, that's the story I'm talking <laughs> oh, about. Well, the day you gonna tell me that story again? This here house used to be an old hospital back in the Civil War. No, you kidding me, aren't you? <laughs> well, like you always know was a joker. I'm dead serious, Bill Bob Jr. Tell me about it, man. I've been spooked out and every now and then, and all you know. Tell me, tell you. They say that. Confederate soldiers worst enemy wasn't the North. Well, you just wait a second, okay? Keep your hands nose, I'm gonna make sure that door is locked, alright? Alright, okay. I wouldn't cheat you though, Bob. You know me, I'm good. Yes, sir, I would never cheat you. New no, sir, I would never cheat you. <laughs> five cards done. Bill Bob, you still back around there? Sitting right here across from you. Oh, tell me that story you were telling me. Well, them daggone Confederate soldiers were more scared of that. Those daggone monsters that they've been hearing about than the ball from a musket from a northern soldier. You ain't kidding me about these stories, are you, Bella? Hey, you kidding me, are you? I wouldn't kid you, Bill Bob Jr. Well, I've oh. known you to kid many a times. By the way, I got aces over Queens. Well, you go ahead and start telling me that story. Well, Bill Bob Jr., happened a long, long time ago. Yeah. Back then, they didn't have means of communication. So these soldiers, once the word got out, it took a while. So they didn't know what they were really up against. I'm spooked, man. I really am. I just don't know what to say. Man. <laughs> but the more I start hearing things, I don't think I... Did you hear that, Bill Bob? Man, Billy. I just don't... I mean, you sure them doors are locked? Locked every night before I go to bed? I make sure that everything's locked up tight. Oh my god, man. Yeah, Bill Bob Jr. I still ring. Damn, 
anybody in here some strange smells in the back of that book something good? Tell you what, my mind must be going to church on me out there. I swear I hear something out there. I've been hearing things. Whew, gives me the shit. You heard that story about old Susie. Susie Ellie May. Ellie May, man, she was the prettiest woman ever lived up in this place. She was killed. Disappeared. Man, they found parts of her, but they never found her head. They never did. Never did. Yeah. I believe I done heard that one. You ever heard the one about Texas Billy Bob Jr. May Bob? No. I haven't heard that one. You playing it. One night he was playing cards about like us. Him and a buddy. He left the buddy's house about one. He never came back. Well damn if he did. You ever heard that story about Ellen? Found one of his fingers in the swamp, but they couldn't be sure it was his. You hear that? My God, I think I did. There's something out there. I'm Check that doorbell, Bob. I am, I am. I don't see a looking thing out here. You wherever you reckon it's the it's the wind blowing or something here. I'm looking around. Nothing happened in these parts. No sir. Bill Bob. I believe all these cars may be constipated, but I think I'm gonna try to take me a dump. Change noise, I might reckon go with you. What do you say? I just you know, you listen here. You go down there and take that dump. I'm gonna hold the fort down here. And you give me a holler. You, you ain't got any problems down there. Okay. Wait a minute.
am I going to do, Billy? Mom! Wake up! What? Hey, my search man! No! No, they killed you, Bill! Mom, they killed you, man! Billy, you okay? Oh, they killed you, man! Having a dream, man! You having a dream, Mark? It's real, man! They killed you! No, they got me, too! There's nothing real in here but oxygen. Let me tell you. You alright, ain't you, Billy? Tell me about it, man. Tell me about it. Man, it was awful, Bill Bob, dude. Awful, oh, dude. Couldn't be no law for a damn little chance. Truck breaking down in the middle of the highway with no one around. Oh, yeah, it was, buddy. It couldn't have been worse than old Peggy Sue being as fast as 300 pounds. His wife about damn way, husband over weighed about 20 pounds. It couldn't have been no worse than old Bill losing $40 at the old gambling station. It could have been no worse than old Billy breaking his truck on the damn bump on the thing on the hill. And you know what it could be? You no know worse. It could have been worse than more than what most of them two days on tires on that curb right there. Old Marty busted two tires on that curb. He turned that beat. Damn if I didn't hear about that one. It could have been worse than Cameron busting his car up all the way up the mountain and having him right back with two to fight. But damn, it couldn't have been no worse. Couldn't have been worse than. Homeboys, I <laughs> couldn't be a worse to go lock up in Savannah. Oh, cold. <laughs> couldn't have been. But it was. And I'm going to tell you here today, it was. Miami, they, I was taking me just a peaceful dump as I could take one. And next thing I know, these monsters come out of nowhere and attack me on the candle lesson. Ain't that a way to go? Oh, no, shit. Ain't no way no one wants to go died, attack you on shit. That's the way you want to go out, Billy. Could <laughs> always been the joke you ever was. was you lost a hand. I lost a hand. I got both of them right here. No, sir. I'm Billy Bill Bob Jr. and I'm sitting there pretty easy place. You lost that <laughs> way. Yeah, and no, sir, Billy. That thing is from DuPont. You can't pull my hand. It's real as it ever was. Yeah. yeah. But tell me, I had four aces in a jack, and you won't run off on the bathroom and leave me sitting with four aces in a jack. I ain't no way. Well, to... Bill Bob Jr., you know what to say, Miss Bill. <laughs> you know me the joker that you were. Oh, no, no. Uh, so, did I get killed in the old dream you have, you say? Whoa, well, did you ever? I mean, it was weird. I mean, Bill Bob, you don't even know. I mean, you just died right there in that floor, right there, right there, man. I can see your face. I mean, you're pretty police blood everywhere in one arm. I'm right here, man. I'm right here. I'm I right here. I love you, Bill Bob, man. I'm, I'm right here, Billy. It was great, man. I'm going to say it to you, Bill Bob. <laughs> it looked like it had me done. Yeah, yeah. Bill Bob's alive. He's alive. The end. <laughs>
What do you say, old Billy Bob? Is this the end? Well, Bill Bob Jr., I believe that's it. Until the next show, this is old Billy and Billy Bob cutting off. <laughs>